Hey spuddies, Potemic Whiskey here and welcome back to Let's Play Civilization 6 as Nubia. We are on track to win, however we do have a couple of people going for a science victory, in particular China who we're trying to stop now with uh, some spy work. Uh, it might not work, but it might work. It seems like we are about a third of the way through all the tourism that we need to generate to get all of the domestic tourists that we need. Uh, pretty much what we're going to be doing is there's a card in here that I forgot to slot in and it is a plus 50% tourism output. So when we hit rapid deployment, I'm going to make that make that change. Uh, commercial hub, what I'm going to do here, it would make sense to build those other things. Uh, you know what, actually, it does make sense to build a market and stuff. So I'm going to build the markets and stuff like that repaired here. And anywhere that I can, I need to trade with China. So I'm going to, I'm going to go all the way over to Zhaodong. And I have an airplane here that's great, really good. I'm going to want a unit to stand on top of that, actually, to keep it safe. So it doesn't get pillaged. I'm going to take Echelon. Right? Or thrust, sorry, not echelon. And um, we'll go into alert mode. So we've managed to navigate our way through the wars. That's really good. Means they uh, they can't stop me. Theoretically. Theoretically, they can't stop me. Boom. That's going to actually... I think that will actually... This used to be 17 tourism. That should bring it up to 19. Yes. Got that little bit of extra tourism. I need to get up to... Um, Despicable leader. That's fine. I don't know why you got to be so weird about it, Russia. He's probably going to want to declare war on us again, but we should be ready for that. And next time we should be much better prepared. I was I was too greedy, actually. In in, in hindsight, hindsight being 2020, I was a little bit too greedy. And uh, I paid the price for it. Now, stock exchange. Um, I'm going to go do commercial hub investments. I just want to do a few of them. Repair the bank here makes sense, in my opinion. I combine these guys together. Then... I look at the old appeal. We squeeze in a national park somewhere. Probably only really up here. Otherwise, it makes total sense to just drop lumber mills. Uh, go into alert mode. Unit needs orders. Go explore. Spy should land here fairly soon. We can start hammering away at his spaceport. Okay, so these guys, so they're denouncing me again, which shows uh, they are annoyed with me because I'm winning. I'm close to winning. I'm not too far away. So here I've completed another spy. This spy will be going. Is anyone else going for a science victory? Looks like nobody else is doing it yet. I'm going to want to kill your industrial zone in China, if I can find one. You don't actually... Oh, here it is in Beijing. I want to kill the industrial zone here. Choose production. Uh, research lab hangar. Why don't you do a campus research grant, which will speed up the uh, acquisition of science points. Especially because we need to get this great scientist away from China. It's actually going to be super important that I do that. So let's see if we can get some more of those. AT crew, go hang out in Nuri. Next turn. Yeah, I've got to, I'm trying to attack China on multiple fronts here. I'm trying to, I need to get this great person so that China doesn't get it. I need to sabotage the space race building, the spaceport. And I need to um, surround myself in allies if I can. Bank here. I think grabbing the market makes sense, but in the meantime, I'm just going to do another commercial investment. I want to get that other guy that gives me... Uh, This guy, Masaru Ibuka. He's like really, really good and I really, really want him on my side. Um, if I put a theater square here, I'll still be able to make a 
National Park if I had to get rid of that. Okay. You can go into alert here. And you can build a lumber mill. I need to gain sources before I can sabotage here. I'm not sure if it's the Earth satellite or it's the moon mission that gives the culture. It's one or the other. Alert, next turn. Okay, so we've calmed things down and we're going back into game winning mode. Uh, it's too bad there isn't a project to get extra tourism. I built a bunch of builders hoping I would be able to make seaside resorts over here and that didn't really pan out, which was kind of actually super disappointing. Um, you know, I'm pretty... I, I'm not like super upset about it. It's kind of just, you know... It's just annoying. I don't know. I've seen, I've seen, like, it doesn't make sense. Like, you, you should be able to build seaside resorts on mountains, for Christ's sake. Well, maybe not seaside resorts, but at least resorts. But maybe that's what national parks are for. Who knows? Uh, let us be friends. That's the world, you know, that we stand united as friends. That's good. So we have four friends and two enemies. And typically the, the, the two people that consider us enemies are the ones that are in the running to win. Um, inner workings of Ur. Okay. We can now disrupt the spaceport here. Okay, who don't we have a trade route with? Trade route, trade route, trade route. So it's Gilgamesh is who we need a trade route with. And I will trade with uh, Ba Tibira. Next turn. Gilgamesh will remember this. Awesome. And choose production. All right. So we just finished a spy in here. Can we get another spy? We cannot. Uh, we want to repair our industrial zone because it's going to give us tourism. Uh, I'm going to send my another spy against China. There's not really much I can do actually against China. I'll send another one here because I just want to have twice the chance to disrupt his rocketry. Uh, I want you to gain sources. Thank you. Making decisions here as fast as I possibly can uh, to get to the win condition. Okay. Looking like we are getting quite a bit of tourism against these guys now. Uh, but they're getting, they're gaining tourists at a pretty rapid rate as well. So that's something we need to watch out for. Globalism, globalization, production, e-commerce. So we're about to hit globalization. I had meant to change my policies here. There is a policy that I want to slot in. It is the plus 50% tourism pressure with people you're trading with. And I forgot to slot it in again because I'm a dumbass and I make mistakes and I play inefficiently. I know that. You don't have to tell me. <laughs> okay, I'm not the best player of Civilization VI. I can, however, consistently beat Deity, which is not bad. That's not bad. I think that's a pretty good. That's a pretty good goal. Although I, I, I still feel like Deity is really easy. Um, usually only like one AI doing like a science victory that's like contesting you. Okay, <clears throat> here in Paris, we repaired the industrial zone. I just want to have it repaired. I don't want to upgrade it or anything. The real dream is be getting this commercial hub up. And uh, I wish I wish there was a way to set reminders. Like, I, if, if someone were to make a mod where I could like right click a, a tech or something and put in a note for myself that would pop up when that tech came up, I could plan my games up out so much better. I guess part of the skill of the game though is trying to remember all this stuff in your head. It's kind of hard to do that while also doing commentary. It's really rough. Uh, let's see, library. Could a library be what we want here? I think I was just doing this so that I could do a campus research grant to try and snipe the uh, this guy 15 turns. Yeah, I think I have just about enough time to snipe this if I can do it. Oh, actually, I might not have enough time. Mm. Commercial hub investment. Grab the stock exchange. Uh, yep, disrupt the rocketry. There we go. 84%. Now he should... Like, if you fail in 84%, that's just stupid. <laughs> I mean, come on. 
I know it's RNG, but still, it's like the XCOM levels of RNG, where you have 99% chance to hit, and it's like, critical miss, you shot your own guy, and now he's dead. Okay, come on, give me, give me like a, a seven turn, damn, all right, can I, can I hyper focus on production and maybe get that down to like six turns? No, I'm not going to be able to do it. Oh, I could purchase them. I'll purchase them. Yep, I'll purchase them. I'll happily spend. I'll happily spend that money. Now I don't have to do this. I can instead switch to a uh, build three airports. Instead, I can switch to, for example, industrial logistics. Would that be okay? Let me see here. Regional buildings provide plus one to many. Respective regional buildings provide reach extra range. Getting that actually wouldn't be bad. So I'm going to do some industrial zone logistics here. Uh, you're going to want to build an industrial zone actually right there. And you're going to want to get a stock exchange. You're going to want to do a commercial hub investment because I really want this guy because he's worth a lot. Oh man, am I going to be able... Am I going to... I think I'll pay money for him. I'll check that, like, I'll try and check that every turn if I can. Grab a market. Oh no, actually. Do a commercial hub investment for me, please. Next turn. Ah, recruitment of great people. We coveted is becoming a real problem. I know, but I had, I couldn't let China get him. Couldn't, could not let China get that guy. It would have been, would have been lights out. Science. Oh man, are we going to, are we going to disable it in time? I don't know if we are. Took too long getting over here and getting this in position. That's part of the problem with Civ is that you have such you don't ha you have such a small window to react to a development. Um, no, you have a really big window to react to a development, but the the amount of time it takes to react to a development is difficult. Okay, that was an Ur. Um, you have a go at disrupting that rocketry as well. I want to do... I already did a commercial hub investment here, so I'll do a bank. I'm getting pretty close to this guy now. We need 5,100. Fill the policy slot. Alright. Uh, thankfully, I got a prompt here. So, I want to do online communities. This isn't as good as this, I feel. Uh, it might be better than this, though. Plus one amenity on stadiums. Could be good. One copy of a strategic resource allows you to purchase units. So don't care about that. Could be good, though. Gonna hurt my gold income a little bit, but it's gonna be worth it because it um gives me more tourism, more tourism pressure. Particularly, oh, it actually actually increased my gold income uh, because now I have the plus seventy five tourism with these guys. So now I'm generating six hundred tourism. Um, once I get, I'm only a few turns away from getting computers. I really should have gotten this a long time ago, but I kind of I got sidetracked because of the war. And because I'm bad, so, yeah. I mean, what are you going to do? Alright, I got this great scientist. I'm going to go... And just, uh... Put him to sleep in this city. I have a builder here, wake up. Do I have any more units sleeping on, sleep, slipping on the job? No, looking good, looking okay. I got a few more traders I could probably use. Let me see here. You. Anyone I don't have a trade route with, I have to check this every time a trade route comes off cooldown. No, we're good on trade routes, so we can just go for the highest yield. Ah, uh, you know, screw it, let's go for Leventa. And uh, Nan Madol. And that'll be, uh, that'll make us be friends with those guys. You know? We can be buddies. Be buddy buddy.
I will pick up that science though. That little bit is gonna help me uh help me maybe shave a turn off my needs. Next turn. I'm hoping to win in the next episode or two. I'm hoping uh, if I, I probably won't win this episode, but next episode I'm 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 hoping that's when we win, so I might do like an extra long episode to win the game. Uh, but I, I am I can feel the, the win creeping up on me here. I'm definitely getting close. Getting close to finishing off this game. Uh, I want to do a pillage of this industrial zone. Let's see here. Uh, I'll get a forest here. That'll improve this to be a plus five. I also want to get another seaside resort here because every every little bit of tourism, right, is uh, is a step towards a win. And that's exactly what I want to be doing right now is uh, taking every single possible step that I can towards winning the game. So let me see here. I have Sasangma Mula. No, I don't want to do this. This isn't this isn't a good deal for me. At least I don't think it's a good deal for me. I don't see any possible situation in which that is a good deal for me. I've said the word deal now too many times. All right, so we're going to choose production here in Leon. Okay, so we just finished the commercial hub investment, which means we are much much closer. We're getting close to getting that. I want to get the stock exchange. The extra gold will be invaluable. I think, in fact, I'm going to go up to maximum with Amsterdam because I want the extra four gold in every commercial hub district. That's going to wind up being quite a bit. In fact, if I were to go in here and click on you and then tap this, my gold just shot up again. I have plenty of gold that I can spend now. Let's stick a lumber mill here. There's no harm in, in not in doing it. Uh, you're going to want to go sleep here, my dude. Next turn. We've got commercial hub projects coming out. I've got an industrial zone logistics project. Really, really want this guy because this would actually be, you know, plus 10, plus 10 um, per city is a lot, especially because it's going to be doubled. It's a crazy amount of, uh, of culture, of tourism. I'm going to delete this mine and then put like maybe a couple of forests here with a seaside resort. Ooh, excuse me, yawning here. I'm falling asleep, I'm boring myself. <laughs> uh, your army is running fished here. My troops are merely pass passing by. I have like one, I have like a couple of scouts on his border. He really feels threatened by scouts, which is fucking crazy. This rock rocketry. Damn it, we failed. That's really bad. Um, because he probably launched that rocket now. Yeah, he did. His, his, did he? Yep. So we need to keep we need to keep that thing suppressed while we win the game. Stick down a forest here. How, how many do we need now? This number is going up. That's going up, but we're catching up to it faster than it's going up. So that should be enough appeal here for a seaside resort. Again, we're climbing that seaside resort rankings. After computers, I'm going to want to pick up steel because that would give my lumber mill improvements a better chance of being useful. Uh, that'll be a good pathway. I don't need any of this crap. Gold to caps. Production to pastures. Yeah. This is all just fine. Plus two air units lost in the aerodrome district. Quarry improvements. Yeah. Maybe we'll go for the quarry improvements after. Rocketry. All right. So seaside resort. Bada bing, bada boom. Then we're going to want to delete this next turn. Unit needs orders. Who needs orders? You. Unit needs orders. Danger. 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 Auto explore. Go. Next turn. Ah, uh, Palenque has been defeated. These are really old. Somebody built Petra. Uh, was that a nuclear missile? Did he just nuke Nan Madol? I think he just nuked someone. That's really bad news. A uh, power plant. I don't need to purchase him yet. 
because I have a couple of commercial hub things going off, so I can hold off on that. I will go for the power plant here because this is where I upgraded the uh, things, I think. And then I will also go into here and steal another tech boost. Let's keep this by busy. Uh, ah, we destroy the rocketry thing. Awesome. So we we did not stop him from doing. You're launching a moon landing? How? Where's your? I need to select a spy, but I can't. I don't have a spy to select. God damn it. Um. Next turn, I might move him home now, actually. That would give me plus one level on every spy, which would be really nice, actually. Computers, one more turn. Here we go. This is where we get the boost. Uh, I will assist the operations right now. I'm sorry. So, I want you to move... Does he have a second? No, he doesn't. So I don't know how he launched that, because I pillaged his spaceport. So I don't know how he launched the second one. That's weird. Uh, I'm going to set this guy to sit on... Probably this industrial zone in Rens. Okay, make a stock exchange for the extra gold. Okay, can I now... I want to wait until these two guys pop off. So two more turns until I purchase that guy. Uh, power plant. We are now making 722 culture per turn. It begins. The end is nigh. We are now making... That should be way higher. Making about 1300 culture to 1000 culture per person. Open borders with Gorgo would be good. Open borders with Gilgamesh. Gorgo. And. Gilgamesh I need to get open borders with. So let me go in here. Gilgamesh. Make a deal. Open borders my dude. Nice deal. Thank you very much. For that extra tourism pressure on you. And Gorgo. Oh. Establish a resident embassy. And Gorgo, I would like to make a deal. How about open borders? Make this deal more equitable. Yeah, I'll give you five gold. No worries, dude. You're good. Yeah, you need some pocket change. It's okay. I'll buy you. I'll buy you like a sandwich, and we'll be we'll be good. Just let just just open your borders. You know, here's a sandwich. <laughs> um, all right. Uh, do I want the power plant here? Ooh, ooh. Well, I mean, I don't really need the power plant here. What I do need though is some housing. So let me get this neighborhood right there. Boom. That's the spot. And we built the stock exchange here. That's good news. Two more turns until that's done. I'm going to go ahead and grab a workshop here. Um, I want to remove this and put a forest on top. I need a, probably more builders actually, funny enough. Oh my god, Scout. You are the worst. I'm going to just delete you. I can't delete you because you're hurt. Get, get killed. Just get killed. Go to sleep. I don't care anymore. I'm done with you guys. You've explored the world. Good job. Actually, knowledge of the world is pretty damn good now. Uh, oh, he's going to give back Nasala. For some gold. Hell yeah, give me back my person. Thank you. And save me the production of having to remake that spy. Okay, is anyone else going for a science victory? Need to keep an eye on these guys, because they're finicky. They're sneaky. Oh, he, he wasn't. Oh, right. Maybe I misread this and my brain turned off or something? I don't know. <laughs> Listen, sometimes I just see shit wrong. Nuclear program, totalitarianism, class struggle. Nuclear program, class struggle, totalitarianism. Did I leave anything back here? Form church. 
reform church into nuclear program into class struggle into totalitarianism into future civic choose new thingy and one more turn until we're ready let me who so what am i going to do here do i just steal gold do i create rebellions Anyone else have neighborhoods? Oh, you have a second one, Zhao Dong. Uh-uh. You're not allowed to have a Zhao Dong. Not in this city. Uh, trade routes. God damn, I have to check this every time. Who do I have trade routes with? Everyone. What was what was your last? It doesn't say what your last thing was. God damn it. Alright, so is there anything I need to slot in here? Yes, e commerce. And what did I even unlock at globalization actually? Let me double check. I'm pretty sure this city just became a powerhouse. Oh my god. So let me check what the... Wait, plus 50%? Pro plus 50 base production towards information error units. Right. And... You trade with Russia. There's no harm in that. Uh, I want to plant woods here. Make this even better. I want to break free. No. So you have two spaceports. I'm also going to send you. I was going to use you as a stationed guy. Actually, yeah, no, I will, because you're giving plus one level to everyone, right? Yes. Next turn. Okay, I'm going to actually, I'm going to wait until this turn is over, but I'm going to call this the end of this episode. So next, next episode, right? Is going to be the push where we really try and win the game because if you look at the tourism here we're starting to we're starting to ramp up heavily we're up to 1400 tourism with these guys um wait that should be way higher it's because of the different governments what kind of government do these people have is there a way to check that is that like a metric He's fascism, monarchy, fascism, theocracy, theocracy, fascism. Fascism seems pretty popular. <laughs> um, not interested in the new government. Quickly end this turn as well. My goodness. My goodness. Goodness. So really now all we're doing is playing this sort of waiting game. We've we've essentially won at this point. Um, it's got to the unfortunate reality. So I'm going to purchase this great merchant. And he shall be used next turn. So we'll do that all next turn. I want to thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys are enjoying this series. Please remember to subscribe if you want to see more videos from me. Remember to leave a like if you want to directly support my channel. Remember to leave a comment if you want to give me your feedback. Other than that, I want to say I love you all very much. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.